Hello, I'm Johnny and welcome back to my channel. So, I'm going to do a book review, but I don't know if you'll find it very interesting because I'm very disappointed about this book. Looks absolutely fabulous on the front cover and the back cover. So they say, never judge your book by its cover. Well, unfortunately I did, and I'll show you inside soon. It's stump work embroidery. That's like raised embroidery, which I really want to learn how to do. A collection of fruits, flowers and insects for contemporary raised embroidery. Jane Nichols Milner Craft Series. It's heavy as well. Um, it says, stump work is a style of raised and padded embroidery that has its ori origins in the 17th century. It incorporates a charming array of motifs, exotic flowers, fruits and insects and animals, all worked as delicate sculptural forms. Oh, it is very heavy. Stumpwork embroidery explains how to work this style in a clear and comprehensive manner. Well, looking at the book that I have, it's not clear to me. Discussing all traditional techniques such as surface stitchery, padded applique, needle lace, and wire detached embroidered shapes. It provides full instructions and step-by-step -step illustrations along with fascinating historical tidbits. I suppose that'll be interesting. For working over 40 flowers, fruits and insects, the projects showcase the author's style which while distinctively her own remains true to the spirit of the 17th century stump work. Nerella Tartan's forward and further reading blah blah blah. So, when I bought this book, I thought it would be all coloured photos showing you in detail how to do this. Because, looking at it, it looks like a very complicated process. So, let's get into it. That is absolutely stunning. Move my glasses so I don't knock them on the floor. Right. There's just so much reading, and I'm a visual learner. So, I mean, I will read bits, but I think the rest will bore me. There, there's no a coloured photos. It just, it's like little diagrams showing you how to do it. But for a beginner like me, I find that just complicated. I mean, it's not even in colour. <sighs> I mean, I never paid expensive for it. It was only about three or four pounds, but still, that's not the point. When I've never done anything like this before, and I just can't figure it out from looking at that. There, look. I mean, yeah, stitches. I'll just have to study at one and look on uh, eBay. eBay. YouTube tutorials because this is just I did watch two videos on stump work and it's like everything's a big big secret they don't show you everything that they do Um, one lady showed you all the materials you needed in the beginning of it and then she missed some bits out in the middle and it's like it's left for the viewer to figure out how to do it and then the completed piece but uh, Say, absolutely amazing. I would have loved if there was a project in this book to uh, do this. But I'm just going to have to figure out that on my own. Yes, so... If you like me and you like loads of coloured photos showing you how to do it, I suggest you buy another book because... No. Anyway... I'll leave that there in case YouTube picks it up as a thumbnail. Right. So I hope you've enjoyed this. Thank you for watching. Johnny signing out. See you bye.